We were recently contacted by a concerned parent who bought her child a scooter from Kmart. When she opened the pack, she was a bit surprised by one of the warnings she found on the inside. There at number 16 was the warning. This product contains chemicals known to the state of California to cause cancer or birth defects or other reproductive harm. Gnarly warning, dude. Yeah, it is. And you think if that was the case, you put the warning on the outside of the pack so you can read it before you purchase it, rather than on the inside. But I guess this warning was more important. Parental advisory. <laughs> Mad content! Even the Kmart staff seem unaware of this tremendous selling point. Oh! I need a scooter where it has chemicals that cause cancer or birth defects. Do you know which one that is? You want one that's safe from it or...? No, one with chemicals that cause cancer or birth defects. Doesn't matter. Know. Somebody bought one and I'm pretty sure it was from Kmart. This is the picture. Do you have that one? MGP Limited. That's, this is the one with the chemicals for cancer and birth defects. I just wanted to clarify whether the cancer-causing chemicals work in Australia or just in California. So that's not our brand. But it bought it from Kmart. Yeah, you'd have to contact them. You don't know if the birth, what birth defects can be caused, like, because, you know, if it's like a cleft palate or something, it might be all right, but if it's like thalidomide, I'm not so keen on it. Birth know. defects? Yeah, so I just wanted to clarify That's what that really was. That's really bizarre. I don't know. No one's ever asked me that It just before. seems like or a strange I warning. I speculate is it'll be something in the paint. So it's the, only the paint that causes the it's cancer? It's either going to be the, what, the paint or the metal. That's all. That's all I can guess. Cancer or birth defects or other reproductive harm. So that's this one, is it? Yeah. Is that what I was looking yeah. for? This one? Yeah. yeah, cool. All right. Thanks for your help. Cheers. But before you rush and take your scooters back to Kmart, let's have a look at why these chemicals are only known to the state of California. That warning's there because of a law passed in California in 1986, Proposition 65, which requires warnings when certain chemicals are used. And here are the chemicals it applies to. <laughs> Warnings like this might seem like a great idea, but they don't tell you which chemicals are used or how much risk there actually is. Oh! Because if you start seeing these warnings on numerous everyday products, you start to ignore them, even if they are actually dangerous. It's a bit like the boy that cried wolf. Wolf! <laughs> Good one, kid. <laughs> so what does this mean for our mad scooter? An Australian-owned brand made in China that can scare consumers based on a law in California. That's globalisation. Yeah, the uh, stunt guy's gone home, Craig. What? Ah. The reason our scooter has the warning on it is because it has lead and cadmium. But Kmart has assured us that... The testing of the MAD scooter has confirmed the presence of lead and cadmium is well under the maximum permitted levels in Australia. So if you see one of these warnings, don't freak out. Although you can ask the shop in question if you're worried about it. And in this case, there's no problem with our MAD scooters, as long as you're using them as a scooter should be used. <laughs> Although I probably wouldn't eat it. Tell me! Kids. <laughs>